what is good youtube steve is here with another banger to bless up the channel recently i went scrolling on tiktok again and i came across this guy who'd be saying some crazy ass shit that i'm not gonna lie y'all need to see now before we get into this video i do have a quick announcement to make that i did hit 500 subscribers a couple days ago and as of this recording i am very close to 600 i just want to say thank you guys so much because i am getting so much closer to being monetized which is my goal for 2023 now just because i get monetized does not mean that i'm just gonna stop the grind gonna keep going and we gonna go past you know people say sky is the limit no nah, we going past the sky man but we gotta take small steps at a time but that's enough talking let's get into the video all right here we is on the boys account and bro it already looking like some crazy ass shit how to avoid child support we finna be in for some shit <laughs> how to avoid child support well one thing you can do is fake your death it's over half screen. a million people go missing every single year why can't it be you or Fake my lead a country, that but don't go to a place that fuck with the U.S. You need to go to Pakistan, North Korea, or Russia, or go to prison. In my oh. state, if you locked up for over 180 days, Hell nah. you don't owe that bitch shit. Hell no, nah. do not or go to prison, Or your boy. baby mama up with a pedophile, and then tell CPS. Dude, I, this is the first fucking video I click on. This... This nigga said go to prison. This nigga said fake your death. Set your girl up with a. I might have. I'm gonna. I'm gonna blur that out and edit it. Or take the lug nuts off of her car, and then when she crash, you file neglect charges. Or get the kid locked up. If the government cares bro, so much about child support, bro. make them pay for that motherfucker while he in juvie. Or as a last resort, get you a lighter and hold a button down so the fumes are coming out. Put a rubber band around the lighter so that the button stays down. Toss that shit in your baby mama tailpipe. And then when she start up the car, boom. You got full custody. Bro. Game is game. No, 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 no. Game is game, nigga? You just told me to commit a series of crimes. Look, look, look. If you're talking about going to prison to avoid it, you might as well go to prison in the first place for something else. Because if you go into prison to avoid the child support, but you're going to blow them up in the end because you put a, a lighter in their tailpipe, you're doing two in one. But, bro, this shit can't be real, bro. But <laughs> we finna go to the next How one. How to date a career, bitch. Look, guys, hoes out here is getting paid. Especially these bitches in the medical field. So if you want to make it out the trenches, this might be your best way to go. So hear me out. Decent looks, being funny, and digging the bitch down good is enough to make her think let me give them a chance and then they'll try to okay. build you up but you ain't no fucking builder bear because eventually you'll Something start feeling pocket. guilty about all the shit that she's doing for you so how do you fix this well you look at these hoes as temporary these bitches are like chests that you would loot in a video game you can get clothes shoes money even a ps5 but eventually she'll start to resent you okay. because she gonna get tired of posting photos of expensive gifts Lying on her ass talking about my man got me this. Guys, look, take everything you can from these bitches and then get the fuck out of there with a 700 credit score. Game is game. How to date a career, bitch. Look, guys. Dude, this shit is like baffling me, bro. How, like, how does he know what to do in these fucking situations? That, that's the real thing. How does he know what to do in these situations? What? Hey man, personally I wouldn't do it. This one, he ain't wrong on. I just left the light, but you couldn't see it because it's in the top right. And I'm not moving this. Sorry. But on to the next vid. How to spot a bitch with a dick. Look. This shit, like, it, it's, he just digs a fucking deeper hole every single video. Guys, it's 2023, so a lot of bitches ain't bitches, especially if you live in places like Miami, L.A., okay. or Atlanta. L.A. and L get a Atlanta awakening. is facts. So hear me out. The first thing you want to check for is an Adam's apple. If they don't have one, look for a scar where that shit was removed. Or 
Tell her you want to see if you can lift like her up. That is Give her apple, a ride Adam's on your back and I've see if you can feel a dick on your spine. Or if you don't believe it's a bitch and they go to the bathroom, when they come out, you need to go into that same bathroom to see if they let the toilet seat up. Or if you meet a bitch in a dark club and they flat chested and heavy on the makeup, you need to stop at a well lit gas station on the way home. You got to <laughs> see this bitch in some fluorescent lighting. Or the voice. If it ain't a real bitch, it's going to sound like laryngitis. Just okay. sneak up behind he, that he bitch right and scare the shit out of him. It's going to make him scream in a primary voice. I just don't want you at the end of the night asking, where'd that little fella come from? Game is oh. game. Oh. <laughs> okay, look. I wouldn't say it like him, you know, but LA and Atlanta is right. You know, those, especially Atlanta, you know, you going to see all of them come out, bro. But shit, he not wrong on this one. How to turn a housewife into a hoe. Guys, look, bitches who sell pussy do it because of two reasons, depression and fear. You got to turn a bad bitch to a sad bitch. And how do you do that? Well, constant gaslighting, oh my being God. unappreciative, and a lack of compliments oh should be the God. perfect ingredients until she have a death in the family. And then she'll start to spiral out of control. If you built up enough trust at the beginning, she won't leave you right away. But you need to provide her an escape. And what's that escape? You need to make the bitch try crystal. And once you get hooked on it, she'll start to lose her friends and her family. And at this point, she'll want to try even more of it. But you got to cut her off and make her pay for her own addiction. This is where the fear comes into play. Because... I don't know how much more I can listen to this shit. And we're only four videos in. He just told me to get my girl on... On crystal? Meth? Meth. No way. We can't be talking about the same thing. <laughs> like, there's so much things I want to say, but She'll I don't do whatever want it takes to say at the same time. To get time. another hit. And that's when you need to let her know how much bread she can make out here on the streets. Guys, even if the bitch had a job before all this, she probably lost it by now. Now she works for you. She suck dick now. Game is game. How to turn a this housewife into a hoe. Trim, bro. Guys, look. How to turn a hoe into a housewife. Look, guys. If you want to take a hoe out the street, the first thing you need to do is take her to a place where she's not desirable. If you got you a white chick, take her to Jamaica. If you got you a black chick, trying to die. take her to Wyoming. If you got you a Hispanic chick, get you another chick because we all want to fuck Hispanic chicks. <laughs> the next thing you need to do is you need to take her to therapy. All hoes got deep-rooted issues as a child. Everybody and she needs does. to be slut-shamed professionally. Another thing you need to do is provide a strong support system. If a hoe tell her hoe friend that she gonna stop hoeing, the only reply she gonna get is, girl, you gonna be back. You need to David Goggins that bitch. You need to make her believe she can stop sucking dick. And the last thing you need to do is install fear. Hoes have fear. the tendencies to relapse and try to step out again. To stop this, keep your pimp hand strong and use it as needed. At the end of the uh, day, hoes want to be wives and wives want to be hoes. Game is game. Bro, you fucking with this guy, he gonna hit you with that, what's that? He gonna hit you with that slick back smack, my nigga. He gonna smack your ass so damn hard. Don't... <laughs> Don't let him... This nigga, this is what a pimp looks like. Right here. This nigga will do any and everything to get you how he wants to. And I'm not saying... Game is game. What bitches got the best smelling pussy? Guys, look. I'm going to go from best to worst. The best smelling pussy on the planet comes from prostitutes. They what? take a shower after every dick they take and oh. after every shit they lay. So unlike a lot of these other bitches, not... you won't okay. find toilet paper crumbs in places that they shouldn't be. Number two is athletic bitches. Because they work out, eat healthy, and drink cranberry juice, it's almost like they flush out they stinking pussy. Yeah, Number three I, yeah. is fat bitches. And it ain't their fault. But if a fat bitch and a bony bitch take a shower at the same time, in an hour, they're going to smell different. Because the fat bitch got a tougher battle with gravity. Number four what? is religious bitches. They pussy stink because they don't fuck that much, so they don't care that they pussy smell like an ear infection. Guys, that's my story, and I'm stanking to it. Game is game. This nigga said, what that's my story, and I'm stanking to it, bro. How to fuck a bitch and get away with it. What? Guys, look. In most countries, it's best that you go ahead and ask for consent before you fuck a bitch. 
Okay. Or don't say nothing. I have, to, bitch, I have to take open out. Open up the window, and you need to be screaming for help louder than she's screaming for help. Say Wait, shit like whoa, no. Whoa, 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 what? Okay, on to the next video. I don't even know what the fuck. Gotta make your dick about. bigger, guys. Look, I, oh, if you want to go from oh, the- hey, 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 I'm gonna have to. Um, one second, guys. I want to turn your shit down, but I'm gonna turn my shit up. Little wee wee gang is. to big wee wee gang. Listen up. If you're a fat dude, you need to lose some fucking weight. For every 35 pounds you shed, you get one inch of dick. That's a good trade off. Or okay. check with your insurance company and see if they provide coverage for a dick transplant. Oh, what? And then break your dick at work. Oh, what? What? You'll get a new penis as work must come. Or no, 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 no. There's no way I'm taking another person's dick. Just pause, 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 pause. What I mean is, is that I'm not replacing my dick with somebody else's. So tie a string to your I'd dick. I'd rather just take and some And tie the pills. other end of the string to a vehicle and then hide. And when the driver come down and get in the car, hop out of nowhere, point a gun at them and scream. When they drive off, Watch that dick grow. Or use a penis pump, but have fun with it. If you got a serious look in your face while you pumping your dick, it looks rapey. Or become a furry, and you can make your dick how long you want it to be. Game is game. I don't know if this nigga spitting facts or plaguing my fucking mind. <laughs> what? Who is going to use these solutions? No, there's nobody who's going to use these solutions, bro. <laughs> Some of them, yes. I think the dip, I said dip, the dick pump is a good idea. But you can't be serious on the car with a string attached to it. You're going to rip it. Man, I like to see that happen. Oh, they took the sound off of this one. Well, whatever. On to the next. How to cop a feel on a bitch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 hey. hey. How to titty fuck a bitch with no titties. Guys, look. Why would when you? a flat chested bitch lay on her back, her titties are liable to disappear. And that's a problem. So how you fix that shit? Well, you lay on your back. Fold your dick back on your stomach. Have what? your bitch get on top of you. She need to trap your dick in between her titties and your belly button. And she need to move up and down until you feel complete. Or have her lay on her back on the bed with her head hanging off the edge. You stand over her head and put your dick in between her titties. Now, because her titties live, your dick ain't gonna stay there. So you wanna push her titties together with your hands, and you wanna hold your dick down with your thumb, and just go at it. Or have her lay on her back, put her titties together, and then lock her fingers, and just stick your dick in there. It's like a hand job, but for titties. Or tape a pocket pussy between her titties, and just fuck it. Game is game. Well, what the fuck is this guy talking about, bro? <laughs> bro, like, anytime he says, or you could do this, or you could do that, it gets worse. I swear to God, this nigga just... The government made this nigga. There's no... <laughs> the government made this nigga, bro. Why feminists want to fuck you in the ass. Guys, I hate to be the one to tell you this, but all of us men get fucked in the ass by these bitches. It's the end goal of the feminist movement. And to be honest, I don't know why these bitches want to fuck us in the ass. But I can assure you, they do. Don't believe me? Wherever your I mean. bitch is, go ahead and ask her. Say, baby, would you fuck me in the ass if I let you? She's going to be happy. She's going to be ready to drop a big donkey dick off in your ass crack. See... This world is trying to confuse you. That's why you got these researchers talking about how men got extra pleasure glands in their prostate. If you don't touch it, you'll never fucking know. They also said that you can get drunk quicker if you put a liquor in your ass. Did you go out and buy a funnel? No. So listen up. These bitches are dickless men, and they won't stop until every single man got loose skin hanging from their asshole. Guys, fuck feminism. Don't let it fuck you. Game is game. Oh, my God. Why feminists want... I'm finna get banned uploading this video. Look at this shit. 
He has like four. We've been across like four videos where the sound got taken down, bro. What to do with some stinking pussy? Guys, pussy can be tricky. Especially stinking pussy. Especially stinking pussy from a pretty bitch. Hey, a nigga like me, you can smell like Davy Jones' locker. I'm going down. Because it's unexpected. And quite frankly, it don't make no sense. Because bitches spend all this money on makeup and not enough money on make down. So listen up. It's three types. The first one is when a bitch pull down her pants and boom, it's like a chemical warfare. Tell that bitch, I stink. And we should take a shower. The second one is like an unlocked That's smart. character in a video game. That's smart. You gotta beat the pussy up enough to make the stank come out. It's almost like you gotta achieve stank pussy. By this time, you already in it too deep. You might as well just start breathing out your mouth and go ahead and finish. The third type ain't pussy at all. This is a bitch who ass stank. Whenever you come across this, just stick your finger in her ass and then put it up to her nose. When Bro. that bitch start coughing, look her dead in her yeah, eye and say, nah, that ain't nah. me. Nah. Now I know it seems like pussy is taking a beating, but goddamn it, that's what pussy is for. Game is game. That's not game. That is not game. Oh, uh, I don't even want to think about that one, man. I'm pretty sure this next one is gonna be the last fucking one, bro. Y'all can go watch this shit on your own, cause I don't think I want to. How to ask this. your bitch for a threesome? Guys, look, okay, I'm gonna have to if you want to eat some pussy one. with your bitch, you should probably take her to the strip club. It's the number one environment to get a third party involved with your sex life okay, without shit seeming so facts. weak. So listen up. Have your bitch wear something with her titties out and then take her to the strip club. Find you a couples-friendly stripper and get your bitch a lap dance. My eyes Inform the stripper itchy, that it's man. your bitch first time at the I'm club I'm sorry, so the stripper would do itchy. everything to make your girl seem comfortable. Now, when you tip the stripper, you're not going to give her money directly. What you're gonna do is you're gonna put the money in your bitch bra and you're gonna have the stripper take it from her bra. Okay. If you keep paying, the stripper gonna keep on reaching in them titties. Buy drinks for all three of y'all to lighten the mood. It's gonna Tease cost them a bitches. couple. It's gonna cost Say, me some money. I'm kinda broke. look cute together. Y'all should probably hang out sometime. After those two bitches bond with each other, you bond with those two bitches. Game is game. Hey. Okay. I okay. He was. Hey. He wasn't lying on that one. All right. Um. That was something. That was an experience that I can't describe with words. Cause it's either this nigga told me how to get your meat longer or how to commit a crime to where your girl don't have custody of your child and blow up the car with them inside of it. But um, Sometimes he has some good advice, but that's all for today. If you guys stuck around to end this video, of course, I'm always gonna appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for sticking around, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. But I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.